Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today is Wednesday, March the 17th and it is St. Patrick's Day and I'm wearing green and I just want to wish each and every one of you a very happy, happy St. Patrick's Day. Unfortunately this year I don't think we're going to be able to see any parades because of the restrictions with the coronavirus but uh, we can just maybe go back and watch uh, parades from years ago. I know I always love the St. Patrick's Day parades because I love hearing the bagpipes and seeing the men uh, marching through the, the parade route wearing their kilts. I just think it's amazing. Um, my children are Irish and I was married to an Irishman for 20 years so um, I have a lot of Irish uh, history and a lot of memories uh, to do with the Irish culture. So I went to the post office today and picked up my Happy Mail. So let's get started opening it. I just can't wait to see uh, what it is. I see some green cards in here, so uh, I know there's going to be some St. Patrick's Day cards. So let me go ahead. I got my knife here. I'm ready to open it. Um, this is from Miss Christina, and uh, she lives in the Bronx, New York. She has been a very, very sweet and loving subscriber for a very long time. Oh, it's got a little birdhouse on it. Oh, how cute. Y'all look how adorable. Hi Glenda, it's been a while. Just wishing you a happy springtime. Stay safe, take care. Oh. I really enjoy your videos. They are uplifting to my spirit. Oh, thank you so much, Christina. This is a beautiful card and such a sweet uh, little note that you wrote to me. I really appreciate it so much. Uh, and this is from Kathy, and she lives in Michigan, all the way up north there. I know it's going to be a beautiful card because you always... Uh, hand make them and they're just so lovely. They're hand uh, hand stamped, I believe. Having trouble getting them out of the envelopes today. <laughs> oh, it's a thank you card. And look, there's an iris on the front. One of my favorite flowers. Thank you for just being you. Oh, I, thank you for the card and lovely note. I realize your time is precious. Oh, I always have time for my friends and my subscribers here. Thank you so much for this. It's so sweet of you to think of me, Kathy. And this is from Patty, and she lives in Las Vegas, Nevada. And Patty sends beautiful cards, too. They're handmade and hand-stamped. <gasps> Look at the butterfly, y'all. Isn't it gorgeous? It's so pretty. Hand stamped by Janet Edstedt. I don't know who she is, but she's a good artist. Blessings, blessings, blessings. Linda, have a beautiful day. Thanks for being you. Love. Hugs, Patty. You're welcome. I don't know who else I can be but me, right? <laughs> oh. I never wanted to be anybody else but myself. Like I said before, if there were a bunch of people standing around in a circle and everybody took their shoes off and threw them in the middle of the circle and then they took turns telling their life stories um, and then they were told, um, you know, get the shoes out of the circle of the person that you want to have lived their life and um, everybody would pick their own shoes out of the circle. And this is from Inez and Inez lives in New Jersey. She's my beautiful artist subscriber. Oh, and this is a St. Patrick's Day card. It's St. Patrick's Day. May happiness often enter your gate and stay very late. It's a Gaelic blessing. That is so pretty. And look, it matches my green top. Oh, look what I'm wearing today, y'all. My Tiffany brooch and my Tiffany crown. Thank you, Zeus. Wishing you a St. Patrick's Day that warms your heart and fills your world with special happiness. 
uh, she said that was a lovely gift from Suze. Enjoy. I'll be looking forward to your St. Patty's Day cooking. <laughs> Just kidding. I've never cooked corned beef. I don't know why, but I guess I need to learn how. Huh? <laughs> Oh, goodness. Oh, here's another green one. Oh, this is from Tammy. Y'all know Tammy. She's up in the Adirondacks right now. She's waiting to go back to New York City. With best wishes on St. Patrick's Day. This is so pretty, Tammy. Thank you. I love the little green hearts. Oh, on St. Patrick's Day and every day, may love and joy surround you because you bring such happiness to everyone around you. Oh, yeah, we're looking forward to the restaurants are open on Fifth Avenue in Brooklyn. We can enjoy a nice lunch. Yes, I can't wait until you come back to New York, Tammy, and we can um, have a girls' day out down on Fifth Avenue. That's going to be wonderful. And this is from... Sadie, and Sadie lives in Pennsylvania. She usually sends me a scratch-off ticket, so let's see what's in here. I love the way that Sadie decorates her cards, too. Oh, I always tell other people how great I think you are. Oh, you're so sweet. Look how cute. Oh, she decorated it so cute. <laughs> There are many leprechauns living in New York City. Hope you find yours today. Love, Sadie. Look how cute. She decorated it with the leprechaun, the rainbow, and the luck. The luck of the Irish. <laughs> Thank you, Sadie. You're so sweet and adorable. And this is from Alice Zillow. Hmm. This must be a new subscriber. I have almost 200 new subscribers. Let me open it and see. This is so exciting. I can't wait. Oh, she wrote Happy Easter on the back, but it's a St. Patrick's. Oh, <laughs> it's St. Patrick's Day. Y'all look, a little boy picking his nose. How cute. Isn't that adorable? <sighs> Y'all really have a sense of humor. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God, look what's inside this card. Somebody sent me a dead roach. Oh, this is disgusting. You are despicable. Thought you'd like a bit of green. Hey, fake beggar, you are pathetic, you can't cook, you fake laugh, you are not special, you are gross and fat. Ugh, nasty ass roach. Ugh. Thought you'd like a bit of green. Your fans love you, bitch. With eviction, Alice Zillow. Y'all look at this despicable. Does anybody recognize that hand printing? Well, you didn't get past third grade, so you didn't uh, learn how to write in cursive? With affection, did you mean with um, affection? You can't, you can't spell e affection either. <laughs> oh, you are some dumb ass. You are a dumb ass. So here's your roach. Is this one of your roommates? <laughs> Zillow sent me one of her roommates. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Lord, help me. Y'all. <laughs> I swear, 
YouTube is awesome. If you are thinking about starting a YouTube channel, I definitely encourage you to do so because you will meet <laughs> you will meet some funny characters. You will meet the best. I mean, the best of God's creations here on this earth. I have just been blessed beyond measure with um, love, kindness, uh, of affection, um, thoughtfulness, generosity, um, gifts, money. I mean, when I go back and look at all the deposits that all the donations that I've received in my PayPal, they've just been amazing. Y'all have such a loving, generous heart. 99.9% .9 of you do. And I want you to know how much I appreciate you and love you. And I want you to know that um, this crap doesn't bother me in the, in the least. Um, this is 0.01%. Um, and it's few and far between. And really, you have to uh, pray for somebody that is this uh, deranged and devoid of a heart and soul. That's all it is. It's just um, a depraved, a very sick, a very sick individual to take the time to gather up a roach. Was it live when you put it in the card? <laughs> Are you a roach killer? <laughs> I hope the poor thing was dead before she suffocated in a St. Patrick's Day card. But anyway, this it doesn't it doesn't bother me, but it does it does show the the evil and and the good. But um let me open this beautiful pink card and I know who it's from because it came all the way from Scotland. <laughs> Oh, I just love y'all so much. You really, really make my life worth living. Oh, it's a beautiful Easter card. Look how pretty. And this is from Anne Flavelle in Scotland. Y'all know her. You were able to meet her in the video that I did. Oh, y'all look. She sent me some sterling. Look, it has a picture of, is that the queen? Looks like Queen Elizabeth. Pretty sure it's Queen Elizabeth. I'm not sure who the guy is. And you'll have to let me know who these people are. So let me read my card to Glenda, wishing you a happy Easter. Hope you have a lovely home with your grandchildren and a lovely time with your grandchildren and family. Happy Easter. Love from Ann and Paul and family. It's just a little something for an Easter coffee and an Easter egg. <laughs> oh, it might be a little something um, in your eyes, Ann, but it's a whole lot to me. It's very big um, because I know that it comes from your heart and it comes from a place of love. And I want y'all to know how much I just adore you and love you. So y'all please give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. And y'all just keep on coming back. Bye guys.